On the campaign trail, one of the talking points Senator Rand Paul hits often is supporting police as crime increases in Kentucky. And today he met with officers in Lexington where he emphasized that point. He's hoping voters take the issue of safety to the ballot box next month. lex 18's political reporter Carolina Buchek has tonight's big story at 530. Senator Rand Paul embraced the support he received from the Lexington Fraternal Order of Police. He says with violent crime on the rise, voters should really keep safety in mind when they vote this November. And we've got to do something about it. Today, Paul told different members of law enforcement that communities across Kentucky, specifically the bigger cities like Louisville and Lexington, need more police. And he thinks the rise in crime Kentucky has seen has people thinking more about safety. But even in Lexington, the murders are rising also. It's not as dramatic as Louisville, but there still are a significant number of murders. People want to be safe, but we've got to get beyond this whole idea that people are talking about defunding the police. I think defunding the police or having no police department, having only social workers is a terrible mistake. He's been using the idea of defunding the police as an attack on the campaign trail. Paul often says his Democratic challenger, Charles Booker, wants to defund the police in Kentucky. And in past interviews with different news groups, Booker's answers about this issue have been somewhat vague. But on Monday night, in a candidate forum on Kentucky Tonight, he said this. What we need to do is fully fund community safety. That means we work with law enforcement, we work with faith leaders, we work with philanthropy, we work with business, we work with folks on the ground to address the social determinants of health and actually invest in dealing with the root causes of crime. So next month, voters will cast their ballots. The question is, how big of a factor will police reform and crime be in their decision making? In Lexington, Carolina Butrek, LXCT News.